Hi folks, some months ago, April of 2008, I posted a video about Japan and I think the title of the video was No Foreigners Allowed Signs in Japan. And it basically, here's his part of that video. The country they enter in. And we have these rude Americans who go to Japan, they go into a bar, and they do what people do in bars here in America. They engaged in fisticuffs, fights. Well, the Japanese don't want to tolerate that kind of rude and nonsense behavior. So they put the sign up and says, get lost, will you? Yankee, go home. And you, know, you really can't blame. But basically what I was talking about in there was that in some Japanese establishments, they have signs which read no foreign is allowed and I sort of like gave a justification for those signs. Well as a result of that video I received volumes, yeah! <laughs> volumes of comments and messages telling me that I was stupido, stupid, hey, 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 stupid, eh? That's what they were saying, that I should not validate such behavior. But I still contend that the misbehavior of tourists, people who travel to another nation, that's a result of your bad behavior. Eh. It has come to life. <laughs> sushi. You all familiar with sushi? I'm sure you are. Well, in order to get the best sushi, restaurants throughout the world get the fish for their sushi from the fish market in Tokyo, in Japan, and I think the name of the fish market is called the uh, called Tushu. <laughs> it's called Tushi. Hey, <laughs> it's called Tushiji, and I'm sure I pronounced that incorrectly. Well, here's part of the market. <laughs> What they do there, they auction off tuna and other fish for the sushi throughout the world. And it's become now a tourist attraction because that dish has become popular in restaurants throughout the world. So when people go to Japan, they go visit this auction area and they create not a disturbance, but they become a hindrance. Here, look at some of them. They become a hindrance to the auctions taking place. First of all, they're touching the fish with their filthy hands. Second of all, as the auction's going on, they're flashing with their cameras, which hinders the uh, auctioneer from being able to see who's uh, calling out during the auction. So they were disturbance. So now what they've done, they're going to ban tourists from this area. Once again, you idiot tourists, misbehaving are getting yourself banned. So now you say, there they go again. Acting like racist and discriminating. No. Because this one, it's any tourist, even Japanese tourists, even me. <laughs> You're banned from there. You have to be part of the operation in order to go in there. Tourists are no longer welcome, welcome because you felt they and you were disturbing the auction. That's it. Folks, we, I just don't understand this concept, how you don't understand it. When you go to another nation, please do not behave as you do in your own country. Uh, I think that's because you're not in your own country anymore. Huh? Make a sense, huh? <laughs> All right, folks. We'll see you. God bless you. God bless America. And God bless the nation you happen to be in. See ya. <laughs> we are springing to the far for 300,000 more, shouting the battle cry of freedom.